but there's a lot of authenticity uh, amongst us all and you can see um, people are all here for the right reasons and you know you, you you're building a great culture uh, Alex um, from the first phone call we had very you, know, you were very sincere very um, uh, authentic in your in your approach and the guys you you've brought in you know uh, you know I like that as well and yeah and it's great we can muck around but there's no um, like it's not a boys club I think that's what mm. one of the words you used before so, yeah, yeah it's oh, and it's, it's people like you Rob where you, you don't muck around like we, we do want to create change in your life and become more and become better and that was what's well, the theme for this event you know Kosciuszko reaching your new peak because there's always more that we strive for and I don't know, mate, what did it mean to you? Like, the, the climb, the peak, like, what, what are some of the great takeaways you've gotten from being together and being with this, this awesome group of guys, and including yourself? Well, I mean, from a personal perspective, I would never have, before I met you, Al, I would never have contemplated doing this. I would have said, oh, it's too hard. Why am I doing that? You know, um, you know, I would have been, I would have been stuck in that victim sort of um, mindset. But... Uh, being with the guys this weekend, it, it, it's been great. Everybody uh, has such a positive mindset and determined to to be better men, to be better people. And uh, I and e each interaction I had, you know, uh, uh, all the guys I was able to interact with all of them, and everyone had this real positive mindset. It was infectious. Um, and uh, and one of the big takeaways for me is that. You know, everyone has a story. Every one of those guys have got a story, but all of them, uh, were, you know, didn't didn't play the victim. You know, and they was and they were determined to be, you know, to grow. And you talk about growth, and this is what this weekend means for me. Mm. Something, everything you explained then, I, I can't imagine, even for me personally, doing it alone, being isolated, especially as we all get older in life, being a father and a man. And I'd like to know, mate. Like, how would you describe RDM? I, I think uh, RDM is um, uh, um, it's a platform. I believe this is the way I look at it because at the end of the day, we're all accountable. Alex, you guys provide so you and the coaches, Drew, uh, Adam, uh, Swain, you guys provide us with a heap of resources and a heap of um, insights to help us grow. But 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 RDM is a platform. Uh, for, for, for dads to be better, better men, better husbands, better, you know, better fathers, you know, even better at work. I mean, I've got, I've got colleagues at work that have noticed, you know, a change in me. Um, and I know how we always talk about how, you know, physical health impacts mental health. You know, they, they've said, oh, Rob, Gina, you're really chilled. And, and, and the last 12 months have been, have been a game changer for me. Um, and, uh, and then what happens is when you stop being that victim, you know, people gravitate towards you, and with 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 RDM, that's what it's that's what it's been for me. It's taken me to a new level um, as a person. Um, so it's best thing I've ever done. A great man, Rob. We, Al, mate, you're great. We love having you in the tribe, mate. I love you, man. You're a champion. You changed my life. Thanks, mate. Thanks. I love and respect all of you for who you currently are but I continually see you for who you can become. It's a gift. It's not my gift, we can all have that. I don't forget that. So it doesn't mean that you're not enough. You are enough. We're living life, what's possible? What can we do?